Him. Uh, New Orleans, they're still in the hunt for their next head coach. They wrapped in an eight hour interview with Chiefs offensive coordinator Eric Bieniemy yesterday, but others are still in the picture. What's the latest there with the Saints you can tell us about? Yeah, I mean, that process is still ongoing. Um, they obviously got a later start than everybody else because they allowed Sean Payton a couple of weeks to finalize his decision to take a hiatus from coaching. I would not discount Dennis, a Dennis Allen in, in, in any way. Um, he's been there a long time. People know him very well. He's done a great job with that defense. And that's a team that right now, um, they have to be elite defensively because there is so much up in the air with, 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 with the offensive side. From quarterback to now this Alvin Kamara situation, you know, with his arrest in Las Vegas to Michael Thomas probably on the way out. Um, if they're going to be competitive, it's going to be on defense. And they already know what Dennis Allen does running that defense, that, that they have that empirical evidence, if you don't promote Dennis Allen, you risk losing him to another organization. So we'll see. But Eric Bieniemy, look, his resume speaks for itself. There's people around this league who are baffled that Eric Bieniemy is still even a part of, of head coaching searches, that he doesn't already have one of these jobs. And if he were to leave, that would leave Andy Reid without his two top offensive lieutenants. Remember, Kafka, the quarterback coach, already went to the Giants. Um, to be their offensive coordinator. So um, there could finally be another round of brain drain on Andy Reid's staff, which he's been lucky to avoid for several years now. Do you want a sports network that delivers everything that matters about the game? The highlights, the picks, the instant analysis, no yelling, no fake debates, no politics. Hit the subscribe button and never miss a moment.